So I have a little bit of a problem with MAC makeup. I've always loved MAC makeup and I don't know if it's because it's one of the first like makeup brands that I ventured out into when I started getting more into makeup. So I went to the MAC store over the weekend and picked up a few things. So I am always looking for like the perfect lip combination. I'm always, well, I look at Instagram and I get really inspired, although they never turn out the same on me. I just always, like I can never have enough MAC lipsticks. I can never have enough of their lip liners eyeshadows, blushes, like you name it. I love everything from MAC. So I will start with the lipsticks because that's what I am the most excited about. And the first two are both mattes. And this one is called Kinda Sexy. It's kind of like a pinky brown, but it's also like a nude. And that's what I'm wearing on my lips right now with a combination of Myth just in the center. But it's really nice. It's matte, it stays put. And I feel like when I wear matte lipsticks, my lips tend to look a little bit fuller. I know that doesn't make sense because you would think if there was a gloss or something they would look bigger, but I don't know. I just, I like it and I think it looks, makes my lips just look fuller. Okay, the next one is called Pink Plaid and this one's also pink, but it's more of like a purpley pink. Really pretty, I love this one. And the last one is a repurchase. This one is called Cream Cup and I just finished one of these, I like, I mean, I got everything out of that lipstick. But that's this shade right here. And this one is a cream sheen, but it's so pretty. You can put this over a lipstick, which is what I usually do. And it just gives like the perfect sheen. It's so, so pretty. And this is like one of those must have colors. Like everyone should have cream cup. Okay, then I also picked up two lip liners. The first one is called Boldly Bare, which is also a repurchase. I had this before and I lost it. I don't know what happened to it. So I wanted to pick up another one. And this one is basically the same shade as Kinda Sexy, but a tad bit darker. And I'm also wearing this on my lips as well. And then the other lip liner that I picked up, picked up is called Subculture. And this one has been on my list forever. And this one's also like a nude. It's a little bit lighter. Um, but this one's really perfect for lining your lips to make them look fuller. Like it's kind of like a really natural lip liner. So you just line, you know, like you outline your lips or overline them and it just looks amazing. Okay, next I picked up another concealer and this is the Pro Longwear Concealer in NC25. They did not have this shade before, so I figured since it's summertime and I'm a little bit darker, this will work well for underneath my eyes. And I did wear this today and I do feel like it's a really good match. So, got that. And let's see here, I did wanna pick up another eyeshadow for my eyebrows. I'm trying to put together a bag that I can take to work or like on the way to work with me when I don't have time. Um, I want to have like a set of makeup at home and then I want to have like a separate makeup bag. And usually I end up putting stuff that I don't really like in my travel makeup bag because I feel like, oh, well, if it gets lost, it's no big deal. But it's just, I need to have like the products that I actually love and use. So I picked up Coquette from MAC and this is what I use for my eyebrows. Just a really nice brown shade to fill in my brows. This is probably my favorite eyeshadow for my eyebrows. And the last thing, this has seriously been on my list longer than any of these things, and it's a blush. And this is called Peaches, and oh my gosh, this is an amazing shade. So this is supposed to work well with everyone, and I do think that it would work with everyone. Um, it's just the perfect true peach. So I am wearing this today. Just gives your skin like a really nice natural glow. It's a sheer tone so it's not like super heavy. It's just really pretty. So I'm really glad that I finally got to pick this up. I don't think I've ever seen this in the MAC store. It might have been like a pro product or something. I'm not positive about that but I found it there so I had to get it. And I believe that's all of the products that I picked up. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.